Hello everyone. So the activity for January's special event is making your own feather for smudging. So you will receive some feathers or a feather with a little bit of leather, a little strip of leather, and then a longer one. So I have taken the liberty to make this feather for my son. So when we smudge at home, we, you can use this. So I'm gonna bring this up a little bit closer so you can see what I've done here. Now this does not have to be that long, but I just saw this uh, beautiful feather and I fell in love with it. And I thought these colors would complement it nicely. So let's see what we can make today. Also, I've gotten these beads, pony beads, just to decorate as well. So we're going to start with, and we also have some glue in order to uh, make this project happen. And so everything sticks nicely. So number one, if you would like to make put beads, you're more than welcome to do that. So I'm going to start with yellow, which is the east quadrant. Then it is the red, which is the south. Black is the west. And north is the white quadrant in the medicine wheel. So what I'd like to do, this is going to, this piece of leather, this larger one, is eventually going to wrap around this, the quill of this feather. So, but I would like to put this at the bottom here, glue it inside so this is at the bottom, hanging there nicely. So I'm going to get the glue. glue these little strips here, right in the center. Making sure that that's the distance that I like, that that's how far down I want it to hang. And now I'm going to add a little bit more glue for the quill of the feather. So, I'm going to wrap it once. So for this project, make sure that you have some paper towel or toilet paper uh, handy so you can, uh, so you're able to wipe a little bit of the excess um, glue that comes out from the sides because you want a polished look and we want to pay attention to the detail. So some make some of the glue may come a little bit from the bottom. We want to just wipe it. That is looking really nicely. And as I can see here, there's a little bit more glue at the bottom. I want to just dab that making sure that none of the glue is coming out. Okay, so 
Now you're going to grab your longer strip of leather and the idea is to wrap it around to secure it together, but also do it in a way that makes the, um, the feather look nice. So what I like to do is I find the middle. So we're gonna start from the bottom and it's just a crisscross action. So starting from the top and then going over. Nice and snug. And on the other side, we're gonna give it a little knot. So on this side, this is what you're seeing, a crisscross at the top. At the other side, we have tied a little, one loose knot. Now we're gonna bring this back around. So another nice crisscross and over here we're going to do our knot. And believe it or not, we're almost done. Okay. So this is what the back looks like. And now moving these strings to the front. So this is the crisscross here. And this is where you are going to tie it up here. Yes, I like the way that looks. And this will be our last knot at the top. So as you can see here, we have a nice pattern going up and every time you do it, if by the time you get to the top and you, you're not, you don't fancy the way it looks, take it out and start it again to make sure that your X's are in the same spot if you, you so wish. Now I'm just gonna cut the ends nicely. Okay, so this is the way my uh, swatching feather turned out. I hope that you have a lovely time doing this with your family. And just to let you know, sometimes you can do this activity with uh, more feathers. So just by putting them together and then wrapping them up nicely together. So gathering possibly three and then gluing it and wrapping it in leather and then you can make it that way as well. So I hope you've enjoyed this activity and wishing you and your family all the very best. Take care everyone. Bye-bye.